Hello lovelies, the predictive papers for 2023 come out on Monday and lots of you ask how I write the paper. So this is how I write the papers. I sit there with the specification open, I sit there with the last few years question papers in front of me and then I think, and this is one of the luxuries that I have working for myself, I get time to sit and think, which your teachers are crazy crazy busy, they probably don't have the luxury of just thinking and I think and I kind of like just write down notes jot down anything that comes into my head about what I think is going to come up on the paper I'm looking for patterns I'm looking for trends I'm looking for big topics that haven't come up over the past few years and then based around those topics I write a load of questions these questions then get sent out to review by three or four different people and there's different levels of reviews so we send them out to university students to check the science to check that the wording of the question can be understood so if I've written it this way do you actually understand what I'm talking about or is the wording of the question a bit too confusing do I need to change the wording to make it a bit easier for people to understand and then we get them checked by examiners so is this an appropriate level question to go into a paper is it too hard is it too easy do we have the right balance of assessment objectives in the paper and then we go through and we draw all the pictures, we draw all of the graphs, and then we get it checked again. These papers have been checked so, so many times. Um, get it checked again and we get it formatted and then it's ready. And then once the paper is ready, what we do is we make video walkthroughs of the paper. So we're giving it a, this is the time it will be the fifth or sixth time this paper's been checked by the time it goes through a video walkthrough. And this really allows us to pull up any tiny mistakes. So if I've written off instead of of on a question, which happens on chemistry paper one, but we fix it now. By the time these papers are gonna be out to you, they're gonna be amazing papers, okay? They're just gonna be so good. And then the video walkthroughs, we go through and we look at the questions. And I've been doing this for years now. I know if the examiners say this sort of thing in a question, this is actually what they're looking for. They haven't told you explicitly, but if they say this, they mean this. Um, so we've got those questions in there. I pull out all the clues that the examiners can show you, what sort of things um, are in the papers. And then we go through all the background science or the adjacent science, so something similar might come up in the exam. And then we talk about how to structure your answer, what keywords the examiners are looking for, what extra things you can throw in there to really make it clear to the examiners why they should give you loads and loads and loads of marks. Um, so these will all be out on Monday. There is going to be a playlist with all the video walkthroughs in. That's going to be linked in the description down below. Just go to it now, bookmark it, come back to it the day before the exam and watch all of those videos. Good luck, guys. I'm going to be here with you every single step of the way. Ouch! This is why in some videos I have unexplained scratches. Thank you.